my support has largely been so far in more of a research capacity, so connecting with the Indigenous Street family to learn about uh, their needs and their perspectives on solutions. Uh, so really taking that time on a personal level to connect with them, to see where they're at, and to be able to follow and honour their voices um, in guiding the work that we do. My work consists of helping family members with BC housing applications. We do lunches at least three times a week. We do building communities where we have people come in from different nations and do drumming and singing, served a hot lunch. Um, we connect people to other cultural resources. We do things like smudging and give them access to sage and sweetgrass. We also provide bag lunches at least three times a week and we do two hot lunches on Monday and Wednesdays which is a big hit on the street for the Indigenous Street family. But nowadays as soon as they see our van pulling up they know exactly what we have so they're super excited to see us which is an awesome feeling just to be out there and getting to know everybody out there. I'm really glad to be connected with the coalition and meeting people and even meeting like family members and just being able to help people. Um, beyond that I also support the 2S LGBTQIA plus community so this is a very important month for us as well. Uh, for the first time the Aboriginal coalition will be walking in the Pride Parade later this month so are really excited to celebrate uh, with our family members, our staff family and larger community as well. And uh, later this month, we will be organizing a Pride event, uh, again for our staff, but also the larger community is welcome as well, uh, to really celebrate our two-spirit relatives and, and the larger queer community as well. So um, the housing sector can tend to be quite an unsafe space, um, not only for Indigenous people, but for the queer community as well. So in everything we do, the policies we develop, the programs we offer, uh, we're always trying to ensure that the, the spaces that we create are safe and inclusive for everybody.